Hello, hello, how's everyone doing today? I hope you're doing good. We're starting right away with the stream stuff. I was already on this world working on that. And of course it starts snowing. Um, yeah, working on that elevator. Uh, now that I look at it, I really don't like the color scheme. I don't know why I went with something like that. But it's, it's all stuff that we can change later. Uh, I have a big problem with that thing. It worked yesterday night. I logged in this morning and it doesn't work anymore. It won't stop in the right place. So I'm guessing it's super sensitive to lag. That's probably the issue. But basically what it does is... Uh, what it's supposed to do is... When I press this button... It goes down. All that's going fine. There's no problem with that. It stops here, and then it goes back up, and the bottom, uh, the, 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 the button at the bottom here does the same thing. And when it goes back up, it's supposed to stop here, but it does not, it stops one block higher. And if I change the settings to make it stop lower, it stops two blocks lower. So it still looks stupid. So, yeah, that's fun. That's really fun. I spent some time yesterday night working on that, trying to do all these little adjustments, make it work, and it does not work. That's so, so great. Uh, so, let's not dwell on that too much. Let's go to bed, and also let's share the stream. I kind of realize as I'm talking, I just pressed start and um, didn't just advertise anything, didn't share anything, so let's do that quickly. We're live. Control V. And already complaining. There we go. Also, why did it take the wrong thumbnail? Why? Uh, that's stupid. That's stupid. Um, we could share it. Uh, where could we share it? I'm gonna share it on... well, on Northern Lights. That's a good place to share that. Giving the, the, the Ice Spike Fortress thumbnail. Why? That's so... That's annoying. Like, what, what what's the point of making a thumbnail if they just decide which one? Which one they're gonna show? That's stupid and annoying. But I'm gonna stop complaining. And just play. Put it in a few places. That's good enough. Um. But yeah, I've worked on the elevator a bit. Uh, I'm also working on the elevator room here. I'm trying to find a nice design. I'm not sure that I like what I'm doing. So I'm doing some iron plates at the moment. And it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Um... Still just, I'm just not sure. But, 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 we advertised something completely different. We're not gonna work on that. We're gonna work on, uh, where do I put that? I'm gonna put this here. We're gonna work on a big Ferris wheel. Because uh, it's, it's kind of a theme park where I'm uh, currently living. And a theme park needs a big Ferris wheel. So... 
how it works um ferris wheels here in the in that mod uh where do i have my stuff and the sight casing and what else the linear chassis oh it's uh right 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 it's not even casings it's logs and the sight alloys and that radial chassis although i mean i need that I'm gonna pick a few but what i actually need is something different let me whoa create let me find the thing that i actually need it's a mechanical bearing Yeah, that's a, that's a mechanical bearing. So I was right with my andesite casing. It needs a shaft. I'm gonna need more than one. Uh, how many am I gonna need? Hello, Mr. Frogger. How you doing, buddy? How are you doing today? I hope you're doing good. I'm doing okay, because I was... Uh, I, I built something last night and it, it, it doesn't work today. So that makes me super sad. But that's not the end of the world. We can always work around that. Uh, slabs. There we go. Oh, 15 minute break before you need to go back to the kitchen. I thought I would drop in. That's you. That's really cool of you to show up. Thank you so much. I'm guessing you've had some. You, you're having some uh, holiday guests over. I'm assuming. Um. So today we are working on a. Um, oh, sorry, I got uh, uh, kind of in my head a second here. Uh, we're working on a Ferris wheel, so I'm just going to show you the um, the idea behind that. Uh, do I have some room? I got some room here. Let's, uh, let's actually put one of those things here. There we go. So, that's a mechanical bearing. If I put a hand crank behind it and I turn it, it, it doesn't really do much. We don't really see what's happening. But if we put some um, radial chassis like that, they should be connected. And why do they need to be sticky? I guess they need to be sticky. But we still saw what happens. With that thing so it's taking that thingy here and it's rotating it um wait would it work with the linear chassis did i get things wrong uh no guess just making pizza dough from scratch and it's it's proofing right now what's proofing i never made pizza dough so i i don't know what's uh i'm not familiar with the terminology here <laughs> Um, there we go, there we go. Oh, okay, yeah, I get it now. Um, but yeah, as you can see, well, it's not really complete, but it's, it's still gonna work to show what I'm gonna do. We have this thing here, so when that rotates, this whole thing is going to rotate, so we're going to make the ferris wheel out of that. Turns out we won't need radial chassis. Um, oh, thank you, that's exactly what I want. Oh, it's resting. Okay, yeah. That's amazing. I want private dating girl chat heart and then private dating girl chat with cherries. Um, report. Um, 
Spam, spam, spam. I can't just remove everything. Just gonna remove all of that. Sorry about that. I mean, I take that as a um, sign of uh, success that I'm getting. <laughs> I'm getting that kind of content. Um. Uh, 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 actually, I'm gonna remove all of that just to show. What's supposed to be happening? Is it if I place it like that? Oh, of course, there's stuff in the way. Um. Okay, so I probably need to make it sticky. Um. Do I have slime? Will glue? Not sure if, if glue is gonna work for that. I'm not too sure. So you're having pizza tonight. That's really cool. Um. So if I place it like that, it works. Perfect. And I don't know if you notice, but something really cool is happening. Let's say I put this here. See? That's so cool. That is so cool. So that part here, it does not rotate. So it, since there's another mechanical bearing, this part doesn't, it, it just turns around. It does not rotate around its axis or around this the axis here it stays stable so that's really cool and that's the whole principle that we're gonna be using here um that's how the thing is gonna work um so let's go outside and start checking out where we're gonna build this thing i'm actually gonna drop everything back here because I don't need all of that on me right now. Uh, where do I put my stuff? There it goes. Uh, that goes here. Shouldn't take too long. Just trying to put everything back in its place. That's good enough. Um, okay. Night time. Let's go sleep. Let's go sleep. Yeah, how you been doing, Mr. Frogger? Hello, Trismo Tripping. How are you doing? How are you doing today? I hope you're having a good end of your year. Better than my elevator, that's for sure. Well, well, hopefully. Because that thing doesn't work anymore. It's being weird, that's annoying. Super sad. Just discovered my channel. Well, welcome! Welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy what you see here. So far, we're working on contraptions that do not work. Like this little elevator here. Doesn't seem to find a way to make it work somehow that's uh yeah things happen youtube algorithm well that's very cool it's rarely on my side that little algorithm it rarely is on my side um so yeah today we're playing some create mod it's a a server that runs better minecraft and create mod at the same time you recently got into create mod videos that's really cool i don't know if you've seen the the one video that i made uh i think it was like a month ago it's, it's i've been super busy lately and i can't somehow cannot make videos apparently um but yeah i i made one video 
uh, from this server where I built a mini game. Do you want to see the game that I built? It was a fun one. Uh, but yeah, but today we're gonna be building a Ferris wheel and I was here because I wanted to look at like where I could actually build it because I, I really want it to be visible from the, um, the bridge, from the train. Although we won't really see it from the front, we're gonna see it when it turns around, so it could be. Oh, 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 I got an idea. I got an idea. Of course, uh, yeah, I'm gonna head there in a few seconds. Just, I just saw that. Oops, bad dudes. Um, okay, yeah, so we're gonna have it more on that side here, I think. It's gonna be the, the, the best place to put the Ferris wheel, like right here in the air, like it, like a that. I was gonna say like a dough, that's not how it works. Words are hard. Uh, so yeah, the first mini game that I built is down here. I called it the Deadly Donut. So that's what it looks like, and when you Look at the lever. There, there's a few player heads out here already because it's a very, very deadly game. <laughs> it was basically a fighting arena on some uh, conveyor belts that switch directions every now and then with some uh, of those little thingies, some uh, beams that fly across the place. It was a very, very fun game. <laughs> fun, fun game. And we can see it from up here. So, like you, you would be fighting someone else or other people, and you have to jump over those things. Make sure you don't get pushed into lava while you push uh, other people into lava. It was a, a lot of fun. It was really cool playing that game. Um, I don't know if Mr. Frogger, you're still in chat. But yeah, you, you, you really missed something. <laughs> if you ever come back, I would be happy to show it to you in person. Um, so yeah, that's the first mini game that I built. Um, and now I want to make a Ferris wheel. Um, and I also built this little elevator here. Sadly, can't seem to work properly. It worked perfectly yesterday night. But then, you know. I went to bed, and it doesn't work anymore. And like n nothing has changed at all. It's it's it just stopped working right. I mean, it still works. It still stops where almost where it should stop, but it not just not quite at the right place. And that really really bugs me. But anyway, yeah, let's not uh, focus too much on that. Uh, so we we're gonna have the Ferris wheel here, but I'm wondering if I should like should I put it like that or like that? Hmm. No, I'm gonna put it like that so that when we see it, like we can see the we can see the train tracks back there. So they're the from back there they're gonna be able to see it from the the right angle. So let's start clearing out some trees. Oops, no, I didn't want to do that. There we go. That's better. So have you been playing Create Mod? Uh, Trismo? Is it, am I saying that right? Trismo? Or, or have you just been watching videos and streams? Of create mod. You're a school student, okay. <laughs> There's no. Uh, I don't get the. To be honest, oh, you don't get the time. Okay, I, I see it. I, I thought uh, you were like saying that as if it was a, a big secret or something. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just found the phrasing a bit funny. But yeah, I, I get it, I used to... Uh, I, I don't have a lot of time 
Well, I have time now because vacation, but yeah, I got that. I I'm quite busy with work nowadays. You do watch videos and stream. Well, that's really cool. But you, if you have time, you should really try it out. It's, it's a really fun mod. Um, we'll do someday, yeah. It, it's really worth it. Uh, so, 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 so... Um, we could start designing the little, um... How big do we want the little, uh... What's the word? What's the word I'm looking for? Also, is that an illusioner? Okay, I don't want that guy around here. Um... right away okay uh let's pretend that did not happen um so i think yeah the little um still couldn't find the word uh the little uh thingies that are attached to the ferris wheel and that where you, you get in i just have shuttle in mind i don't think that's a shuttle i don't think that would be the right word um but they're probably gonna be like three by three and with banisters, we could make them like even a three by three would be a uh, would be a good size. So yeah, we're gonna do that. Um, uh, well, actually, just need to know that they're gonna be three by three. Well, let's just have a, a bit of an idea of how big they're gonna be. Just, just to be sure. Um, they're gonna be like that. And then... Wait, uh, is it big enough? Yeah, it's big enough. Um, so we're gonna have a few of those. We're gonna have probably eight of those. And... How many seats can we fit in? Maybe two on each side. That would be good. And then, and then, and then. Actually, I think the uh, end part's gonna be here. The, the 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 thingy that kind of goes over. I really don't have any vocabulary this morning that's sad uh so we do that here so it's gonna be kind of like that that's gonna be attached here maybe on top of that or behind it yeah it's probably gonna be behind it and just to make it look sturdy, we're gonna have it on both both sides, probably. Uh, I'm trying to see it in my head how it's gonna be. How it's gonna be attached. Oh, and now I need to sleep. Wait, no, I can go sleep here. I can go sleep. Um, so, I think it's gonna be two blocks wide on each side with maybe a gap to reflect that one gap there. Um, so the base is gonna be kind of uh, like that. I don't know why, but I need to place them that way. And same thing here. Uh, 
That tree is a bit too close, so let's tear it. Let's cut it down. Tear it down. Cut it down. No tearing necessary for that tree. Um. Plus, we need more wood. Um. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Kind of forgot to. Uh, Look at what kind of uh, what kind of circle I'm gonna do for the wheel. Like how big the circle is gonna be. But if those little thingies here are, hmm. I'm gonna open. A circle generator. Give me a second. Would that be big enough? Uh, if it's 25, is that gonna be big enough? Yeah. It's gonna be big enough. Okay. So we're gonna start working on the circle itself. Gonna start by making it out of dirt just to have a rough idea of how big it's gonna be. Uh, seven, two, two, one, one. Okay. Okay. Won't need that. hope you don't hear me drinking my coffee some people find that disgusting I'm sorry if you do but coffee is necessary this morning it's just a day a day like that um so I'm thinking this here could be kind of the the, uh, the axis where it's attached so, it's gonna be like on the inner part of the circle here. And the center of the whole thing is gonna be, it's gonna be around here maybe. Wait, 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 wait. Let me look at it from further back just to see. Yeah, the center is going to be here. Okay. We're going to have it here. Let's remove a few trees again. Make ourselves some room to work. So, I think that's the right, uh, the right position. Let me just look again. Or the right position, the right length. It is not the right length. It needs to be one block shorter on each end. So from the middle, it's three on each side. Then it was two. Two again. One. One. Two. Two. 
and then one, two, three. Wait, did I put three? One, three, two, two, one, one. Is it obvious that I'm a math teacher with the way I count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and that's all I can do from up here. There we go. Give me a second, there's just something I need to look at. So. Oh. Thought I was getting a text message, but no. It's just my monthly reminder to pay my rent. That's a bit sad. No one wants to talk to me. Huh. So sad. Um, but, but, on that note... That's not that big of a deal. I can I can deal with that. I'm not actually crying. You can see me. You can prove it. Um. Oh, how big is that little thing? Let's take a look at that. Oh yeah, that's good. That is good. I am very happy with that. Uh, 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 I'm thinking of also uh, making a, well, no, first I'm going to make the little uh, ray thingies in the middle, or, 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 I'm not sure what I should be doing right now, um, yeah, no. I'm gonna... I'm gonna figure out a color palette for that first, I think. Or, well, no, I, I wanna see how big it's gonna look like from outside, and if we can see it through the three, the trees over there. Not through the threes, that's not how we talk. Omni, you know that. Yeah, we don't see it all that much, sadly. Which means, maybe I could make it bigger. Are you guys still there? Why are you still here? Go away, no one likes you. Stupid, stupid villagers. How about here? No, I can climb the rails here. I need to climb the hill. Also, it's getting nighttime, of course. The moment I step out of my. of my home. We lose sunlight, of course. But. We can just make it quick. Look at it from here, and. yeah. Yeah, it can be bigger than that. It can be bigger than that. That's, that's something we can do. Uh, so let's sleep. <clears throat> Sorry. 
sorry, I got stuff in my throat. Should have moved my face further away from my mic. That would have been better. Um, so three, one, two, one, and then it starts the other way. Uh, same shape here. Three, one. Actually. Three, one. Three, one. Uh, can I place here? Yes. It's instead of twenty five, it's going to be twenty nine. Um, three, one, two. One, and then from here goes up two, and goes up by one, goes up by three. Did I do it right? Three, one, two, one, two, one, three, and then... Did I come the right amount here? I'm not even sure. Anyway, we'll do it on the other side. it here yes I can perfect so I can climb this Excellent. And it all lines up. That's perfect. Um, wait, I lost count now. One, two, one. Okay, no, that's it. Two going down. One out. Two. Uh, one, two, three. But this one should be that high. I can leave that inside. I don't actually care. I'm just gonna remove these ones. Let's look at it from further out. No, I messed this up. Wow, I really, really did. What did I do? What's wrong with that thing? Uh, one. Okay, yeah, this whole part goes down by, by one. Okay. 
Not sure why I didn't try to build it from above and I tried to build it from below. It's a weird choice. Um, we need to go up a bit more. anymore. Oops. Well, that was sad. No one's writing any messages. So sad. Uh, okay, so now it should look right. Yep, that's perfect. And it's bigger and higher. So that should be, it should make it more visible from the other side of the river when we come in. Let's eat some food. Still here! I'm just scared that there's gonna be one of them with a banner. I don't wanna get the stupid battleman thingy. Okay, we didn't have one with a banner, that's good. Is my quiver full? No, it's okay. You'll have a bit of room. Well, those trees are hiding yet, but at the same time, these leaves, they should not be here. one here. Yeah. Yeah, that's perfect. That is perfect. Okay. enough okay we're done um so we're gonna attach the um, the little uh, again I don't have the word I keep want to say shuttle but I'm gonna use the word shuttle for that you're annoying you're annoying stupid elevator who made you why are you the way that you are um, but yeah uh, we're gonna place them one block in. Uh, I'm just not sure what kind of block palette I'm going to use for that. I want something quite bright and we got ether planks. I think that's perfect. We need more than that. And we're going to need um, a more uh, subdued color. So maybe the Zelkova logs would be good. Or like the main part of it. Kind of a orangey, but not too bright. 
Uh, we can't really use the uh, enchanted planks because they're weird. They, they really are weird. I don't know how to use them properly. Uh, like, in some cases, you there's I think there's no tool to break them, or you have to break them with the pickaxe. I think it's the vertical ones, which aren't really vertical. Anyway, yeah, they're, they're weird. They are. Um, so maybe the little shuttles could be made with the ether planks. I'm gonna use the Zolkova logs for uh, there's the Zolkova planks for the. Uh, the main part of the wheel. Hmm. Uh, so let's go to the wood storage place. Because we're going to need to gather some trees. Yeah, that's a good. That's a good um, choice. Just gonna pick three of those. Oh, no, oh, and ether wood. I need some of that as well. It's this bright blue one, I think. Yeah. I pick two. Should be good enough. Oh, and I could pick two colors for the shuttles. That would make sense. Have something a bit brighter. Yeah, cherry would be good, I think. I, I already have some cherry, so I'm not gonna pick some from the chest up there. But yeah, I think that's a good choice. I think it is. it's gonna stop it's so weird that it does that how long does the button pulse last okay it lasts long enough Oops, no. Come back. Please come back. I really like that song. The uh over enthusiastic trumpet is is amazing it is perfect
Wow. It's a big one. Is that tree? Holy cow. What? Okay. We got one. We got another one. And we got all the rest. Holy cow, and it's not even done, of course. Of course. There's some other branches. How many stacks of wood did I get doing that? Ah, huh? not as much as I would have thought. There's still some down here, but... Uh... Okay. <laughs> Holy cow. Yeah, I'm not gonna be growing those trees too much, I guess. Getting a bit complicated to harvest all those logs. Three and a half stacks, that's good enough. And from one sapling, I got over a stack of saplings. I'm gonna make another one. I just need to see it from further out, just to see how big it is. Yeah, that's a massive tree. Um, yeah. That thing is, I do not have an elytra, so would have been pretty useful to be able to fly to the like the mid part of the tree and and start cutting it down from there. Um, 
Now I'm starting to regret my choice of making that uh, that pillar there because because of that exact reason. <laughs> I think it wasn't as big as the previous one, but still, pretty massive trees. I guess I just need to figure out how to uh, properly cut them down to make it make it easier. But yeah, I think. Like ender pearling on top, and then uh, and then uh, what am I trying to say? Yeah, gotta get gonna get down like layer by layer. Is probably the best course of action, the best strategy for those trees. Yeah, and I got over three stacks <laughs> when I already had some. I had saplings. Of every type, of course. Uh, we're gonna put this here. Don't really care all that much where it goes. Oh, and the witch hazel tree. Oh, we could have. Okay. These are bulbs. We don't take those. What do we do with that? food. And it just makes you glow. Why? <laughs> Why? That's a strange choice. Oh, that's here. Ether bulbs. Uh, come on, just erase everything. Ether bulbs, ether button, ether bush. Yeah, there's nothing here. I'm just gonna leave it here and pretend like nothing's happened. Um, so what's the color of that witch hazel wood? Yeah, that's gonna be the two. Again, not sure of the right word. I use shuttle, that's probably the wrong word. But yeah, that's... Uh, do I have saplings here? But that... No. Witch hazel saplings, I do not have those. I'm gonna need another chest, uh, so I'm gonna make it... I'm really gonna need to have a better storage area because <laughs> right now it's it's quite bad. I never focus too much on on storage systems, but this one's a tiny bit too uh, too boring and uh, not not that useful. I'm gonna keep that uh, that dirt on me. 
And I'm gonna grab a bit more of that bone meal. Oops, it's night time, of course. Let's go sleep. Let's go sleep. And we can go back to get some of that green and gold. Three, I don't remember the name. Uh, Witch Hazel. I think. I think. I think it is. I don't know where that zombie is. It's super annoying. I didn't have that sapling. I thought I did. I thought I saw it. Anyway. Anyway. Uh, where am I? That's where I'm going. Probably another tree that I cannot cut down in one go. Oh, I can. Well, that was a nice surprise. Perfect. That one is too big. Or... Okay. That, that was weird. Um... Why? That's weird. Kinda looks like it doesn't register that it's one tree. That was weird. That was strange. Here, let's cut down the last one. There we go.
Um, uh, so let's grab the mechanical bearing. And, 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 what else? Nah, just that for now. Actually, no, 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 no. Um... of the ether wood um okay so we got some zelkova logs both of these colors are going to be used for the uh the little cabins that's the right word cabins yes little cabins of the uh the ferris wheel i'm thinking maybe we could use some maple as well because like the th there's gonna be three elements to the ferris wheel there's the the kind of a frame that holds the wheel there's the wheel itself and there's the cabins held up or attached to the wheels so um so The frame could be made with maple, the wheel itself with Zelkova logs, and maybe some other colors just to give it a, a bit more color. And yeah, I think that will work. I think that could work. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna grab a bit of that maple. Where is maple? So I'm gonna keep on harvesting some logs. I thought I was about to start it, but not not yet. But that shouldn't be too long. Didn't take too long. Pretty soon we're gonna have our um, big ferris wheel Yeah, that should be enough. That should be enough wood. Yeah, it's gonna be enough. Oh, wait a second. I'm gonna get in and look at that. Uh, what wood types have vertical slab? Uh, 
Uh, there's the basic wood types, but other than that... Blossom has vertical slabs. But I don't think any other wood other than the basic ones. Which is super weird. Like, I get why, because they're all made independently, but... Like, Blossom is part of Quark. Oh! And not Zilkova. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Wait, no, is Blossom part of Quark? Is the... the, the, the... Okay, yeah. Blossom planks are all part of Quark, and these ones are part of all the biomes you go. And it's night time. Again. As usual. Hey! Said I was jumping down there. Hello, Devon! Hello, hello, how you doing? How are you doing, my friend? It kind of makes sense. Kind of. Sort of. Still not convinced. Oh. I'm doing good, I'm doing good. We're building a big ferris wheel. It's gonna be a fun little project. So that's gonna be the size of the wheel. Don't mind the partial inner circle, it's not... Th that's not relevant. That is not important for now. Um, would have been cool to have something that has vertical slabs also. Hello, Mr. Creeper. Can you go away now? I said go away, don't not, like, avoid my arrows. I'm trying to kill you. Thank you. <laughs> so, 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 so. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna start with the orange part. Yeah, hopefully this will be interesting. So there's this super cool mechanic. I, I showed it earlier, but I'm uh, going to show it a bit later just to show like how I'm going to make the actual Ferris wheel. But there's this um, uh, mechanical bearing. So it's kind of a, well, I was gonna, well, kind of like a piston, but instead of pushing, it's rotating blocks and um create mod is always interesting it is it actually really is um so yeah it, it grabs blocks and it rotates them and when you put another one within the blocks that rotate you can make a um a uh Uh, the, the the bearing within like the rotating part will stay stable so it will also rotate in the other direction so that it it stays with the same uh yeah with the, the, the same orientation so that allows us to make 
Some very cool stuff. Uh, put, put this here, that here. Uh, yeah, it's going to be writable. And everything, it's going to be... Uh... Yeah. There's just one thing I'm not 100% sure of. And it's... Because uh, there's going to be eight... Uh... I think they're called... Ca they, should, they would be called cabins. The little thingies where you, you, you sit. Would that be a cabin? Anyway, yeah, th th there's going to be eight of them, so there's going to be four, like, uh, top, bottom, uh, left and right, and some on the diagonals as well. And, um, so yeah, I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to make it stop for the diagonal ones, and I'm not sure if it's going to like keep working or if it's going to keep its position or if it's going to try and lock into a different position so we'll have to see and find out Carriage, that would be a better word. I, I was using the words cabin, and before that I used the word shuttle, which makes absolutely no sense, but it's the only word that I had inside my brain to uh, describe those little thingies. Yeah, cabin kind of feels like something that's closed. And it's not really closed, it's just... There's like a little fence, but other than that, it's not... It's still open. They're, they're the same thing, you're totally right. They definitely are... Um, now that I'm looking at it, I don't know why I didn't make all of that two block thick. Like, at least the corners here. Um... Yeah, they are basically the same thing. Um,
you built a beacon pyramid wrong. <laughs> eh, it happens. It happens. What did you do? Or are, are you asking like asking me to figure it out in, in the sense that you, you can't see why it's not working? Is that what you're actually saying? <laughs> Okay, yeah, you're not sure. Well, you know. Beacons are quite new. <laughs> Yeah, just eight years. So, you still don't know what you did wrong, or...? <laughs> so it's... the base is, is nine blocks, then seven, then five, and then three. <laughs> I just saw your message not asking, just sharing. It's it's alright, I get what you mean. <laughs> I didn't take it personal, don't worry. <laughs> but yeah, I, I usually try and just count the blocks in advance because I, I always mess up as well. The most annoying thing is like when you somehow for no valid reason you miss a block in like the third layer and you can't really see it because it's like it's hidden under the other ones and yeah that one is quite annoying that's uh annoying when that happens Okay, that's good. That is good. Um, again, I keep doing that, but I want to see it from further out, from the other side of the river, just to see how. Uh... Oh, build the pyramid shifted over one block. Yeah. What's annoying is when you start it and like you make the first layer like 9 by 8 You hate my circles? Why do you hate my circles? What's wrong with my circles? Perfect every time. Yeah. Well, I, I I use a machine to tell me how to make circles. <laughs> like I didn't just wing that one. You know, it's uh... uh... dang it. Build it off by one block. But I can always move everything back. 
It shouldn't be a problem. So, a five block gap. Actually, no, I'm gonna find the center. Uh, I'm gonna grab more of those. It's super annoying. Look at that. Look at my elevator. Do you believe me when I say that yesterday night it worked perfectly, it stopped at the right place, and now if I adjust it so it stops a tiny little bit lower, like the... the, the, the like making it just a one... well, not one block lower, but like the only possibility that I have to make it go lower, it's gonna go down by two blocks. It's super annoying. It's the worst. And it worked perfectly yesterday night. When I did it. But now it doesn't. But. It's super fun. Because it's, autom it's automatic. It's always on top. And uh, yeah. It goes down. Rings a little bell. You get out. Then you go back. Uh, th then it goes back up. Look at that. So annoying. Yeah, to be fair, I don't do it by myself, by myself. I <clears throat> I do it by myself using like outside help. Um And then you can call it again. It comes down. And also sometimes when it, it goes down, it stops for no good reason. Like, not halfway, but just a tiny bit under. Yeah, it, it works. It, it's all functional. Except for that. that <laughs> I want it to stop just one block lower. Just one. And and I can't stress this enough. It worked yesterday. It did. It's so annoying. It, it's so stupid. And like, if I adjust it so that it's... A uh, tiny bit longer. Maybe send it. Look at that. Well, first of all, there we go. It stops. Though I could maybe correct this here. I had it on 8 ticks and it seemed to work. But yeah, sometimes it just stops there. Or again, no good reason. And it comes back up. I really like the fact that there's a little bell that rings to tell you to get off. And another bell that rings. Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Can't tell me that's not stupid. Am I right? I ch it changed it by 1%. And... and like, it's, it's a 20 block height? So, like, it should be 5% per block. Oh, wait, no, because that's the based on the total length. And... The police total length is probably 256 or something. Anyway, yeah, so now it's stopping just short. So, I lower it by just a tiny bit. The least amount that I can. Now it goes down. It goes down, and it comes back. And it goes too far. And you know what the worst thing about all of that is? It worked yesterday. Like, 
12 hours ago. No, not 12 hours ago. But like 15 hours ago. It worked. It, it, it's just trying to make me angry. At this point, it's just trying to make me angry. Um... So... Yeah, the, that's gonna be a five wide gap. And then... Eagle, eagle elevator, just because it's a, it annoys me. Is that so? You think that's funny? Ooh, look at that magic. Look at that sorcery. Um, also. I was gonna say this tree has to go, but it already went away. Just not totally. Sorry about that. Oh, right, I can do that. Oh, that's fun. That's great. Mm, that's not as great because it shouldn't be there. But you, you, you still get the trick. it I wanted to catch it I'm just gonna go to bed
Okay. That's done. Ah! Why were you there? No one likes you, stupid creeper. I'm gonna repair that tree. Uh, I can't repair the tree. I'm gonna cut the tree down. God. Stupid creeper. <laughs> well, I can guarantee the creeper scared me as well. <laughs> That I can, I can guarantee. Annoying thing is, I have one of those uh, magnum torches. Well, that would have been faster. That, that, that was faster anyway. I'm gonna have to go and place some, some more around the place, because apparently they're not good enough. Where are they? Yeah, I had, I, I've already placed one of those in the middle of the place, but apparently it's not good enough. <laughs> Gonna need some more, because I'm still getting creepers. One aspect of create and bring it to vanilla. What would it be? Well, it's kind of a tricky question because it's a, it's a bit vague. Uh, because, like. One thing that I really, really enjoy about that mod is the fact that, um, well, the, the two things that I like the most about the mod is the, the, the fact that it's kind of like redstone, but pretty, because redstone is a, a bit, it's sad to say, but it's a bit ugly. Um, like, you got things that are cool, things that move, but the redstone dust is just or it, it's just lighting up and and it's not that pretty it doesn't like it, it's not really aesthetic i don't know if it makes sense so that's one part but it's it's a very vague concept around create compared to to redstone making it like the the, the mechanic aspect of it like if you look at that okay, well I'm not sure which one, uh, what I should be showing, but like, when you look at that, you know, you got cogs rotating, it's, it's, it feels so alive. And you got this big shaft that's rotating, also, like, it's, it's cool, you know, it, it feels alive. Um, and, and that's something that I feel is a bit missing with current redstone. Uh, but I think that well, one of the things that make it work the most is that, like, if you look at the pipes, if you look at the cogs, the shafts, everything feels 
Minecraft and not modded Minecraft. Like... Uh, it's not night time yet. Like... I, I, I like the blocks that are there and I'm, I'm using them, but if you look at this, the soapstone, it doesn't feel all that like vanilla Minecraft. It, you you kind of look at it and you see a modded thing. I don't know if it makes sense the way I'm saying it, but that, that's kind of how I um, I see things. Or this these blackstone tiles, they look good, but it, it it's kind of apparent that, like, that's part of a mod. I, I don't know if it's just because, uh, because of, well, because I'm, I know Blackstone and I know that it's, it's, like, that's not in the game normally. And again, like, it, it's not a criticism on the, the, how good it looks. It's just, there's a tiny little something that feels a bit, off just enough that I know that it's uh, it's part of a mod but when you look at the like the cogwheels and the shaft and all of that it does feel like it's an like it, it follows the artistic direction of the actual game is what I would say or how it it feels to me The clock, not as much. That, I, I will say the clock, not as much. But the, the other things, in general, they, they do feel Minecrafty. The The pipes, in general, I have to say also, it, it does feel a bit further away from what we're used to or what we would expect from Minecraft, like having a tank like that. Filled with lava, it's uh, yeah, feels a tiny bit, uh, again, a tiny bit off, but still, like in general. But that's another one of the things that I, I like, but that's not something that we could bring, but it, that we could bring to vanilla. But just the that little fact here is what I, I think really helps me enjoy that uh, that mod more. On that note, I really have to go to, uh, well, I have to take a break. So I'm just going to sit down on this, uh, your couch. Going to let you look at me with my little gear backpack. And I'm going to be back in a few minutes. Uh, going to mute my mic.
And we're back. And we're back. Oops. Forgot to get out of F5 mode. Okay. My mic closer to my face. Well, not too close to my face, but you know what I mean. Should I sleep? Yes. If I've used Swift, uh, Swift Sneak, uh, I have not. That obelisk thing. Uh, that? That's a waystone. So it allows me to teleport to other waystones. It's an, a way to get some uh, some fast travel. Like that. So if you use waystones that are close enough, there's no cost. But if you want to go further away, um, you can. Uh, you, you need to uh, spend some uh, some levels. It's, it's an interesting way to uh, to do things. Almost had a demo like that. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't mind the usual way of doing things, like nether portals and tunnels like that. Uh, but I get... I get the idea of... Uh, of using fast travel like that. I also like the, the fact that it has a cost. <laughs> you just use uh, TP blocks, yeah. Yeah, I mean, if everyone's okay with that, that's that's cool. There's no right or wrong way to play the game. Well, the only right way to play the game is the way that makes you have fun. Um. So, one more, I think. Sorry about the sniffles. No. Wow, I was way off. That's bad. Um, so here that's gonna be where the center axis is gonna go. Um, and then we're gonna have some more of those little, uh, what do you call that? Um, yeah, there's, uh, there's seasons. So, like, right now, we're in the winter. Seasons last a few days. I'd, I'm not sure exactly how long they are. But, yeah, I'm, I'm in a place where it snows during the winter. So, we get snow. Uh, but later, later during the day, it's gonna turn into, uh... Spring and then summer and well, I think you you're familiar with the seasons, I guess. I, I'm gonna assume. <coughs> I'm gonna assume you're familiar with that. Ah. No.
No. Um, yeah, it's, um, it's cool, but it shows me why I wouldn't want them to be in the actual game. Because you can't get, like, a consistent look for your base. Dang it. So that's uh, that's a bit annoying. But other than that, yeah. The, the idea is good. The way they're doing it, I I'm not a big fan. Um uh. So, I knew I'd have a problem like that. Uh, I just read your question, just I, I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with that. Because that looks like it's two blocks wide. I don't want to make it three blocks wide here. Feel that would be too much. Uh, and again, we don't have vertical slabs for this type of wood. And I really like this color of wood. Um. So my the solution to that would be to just have it so that I uh, just to use a different type of wood uh, and I think the only one the, the only woods that have vertical slabs are are the uh, regular Woods, so acacia, birch, dark oak, all that, and somehow blossom. So, although blossom could be. Could be nice. But, there's just something that I'm scared of. Uh, with that, and it's that. Um, just gonna place it here. interesting um also i'm gonna get to your question soon uh but one thing i have to check is uh i'm gonna need a normal slab uh but to get to your question um well better minecraft <laughs> Give me permission to totally ignore ignore you. Uh, I'm, I'm not ignoring uh, ignoring ignoring you. Um, well, one thing I don't like about better Minecraft it's a bit hard to say because uh, well, first of all, you can always ignore the parts you don't like, um, but. 
I think I'd go with like kind of what I was saying earlier about some stuff but then again it's for modded in general and better minecraft isn't that bad with that part but still like things that feel a bit off uh compared to uh yeah they feel a bit off compared to uh to regular vanilla minecraft uh but another thing how about create we we'll create I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Well, I I use it because like it's it's kind of the end game thing to use, but I'm not necessarily a big fan of all the engines and I talked about it earlier, but the uh the fluid tanks like that's okay, it's like it works with pumps and all of that. <coughs> and pumps that work with the other stuff. But like the the boilers and stuff like that, steam engines. One thing that I'm not necessarily a big fan of, I can um, well, okay, no, the, the, I I see a few things that I can mention. Um, here, the heat source is a blaze burner, which to me feels a bit off with the general theme of like we're doing like cogs and and mechanical stuff and you got like a blaze burner which is now now that's magic i i don't know if you get what i mean like you you give it lava and it it heats up and it's like it's a blaze so i i i yeah i don't know it feels a bit weird to me the fact that it's kind of it's it's off from create mod but it's kind of connected with the a bit whimsical part of minecraft like uh and and the, the regular vanilla minecraft but in a more whimsical way <laughs> yeah a, a bit but like it's it kind of feels like it's the only thing that is uh that is, uh, yeah, fanta fantasy. Like it, it makes it arcane punk, or well, there's no, there's no, no punk here. But uh, anyway, that's a discussion for a future time. But like, yeah, it turns it into of an arcane thing, a, a magic thing. And the other thing that I don't like, and again, like I, I really like watching it in action. But it's the, uh, these mechanical arms. Again, it feels like way beyond what we already have in that, uh, in that thing, in the, the, the mod. But then again, it's, it's like, you can't work without that. You, you can do that with hoppers, for example, or dropper systems. So, yeah. Mechanical arms and redstone links, same thing. Like I, I use them because they make things so much easier. Like it, it wouldn't be like you can make things work the way they do without that, or I, I couldn't make what I did without that. Like look at my my redstone. I don't know if you know what redstone links are, but they're basically they're wireless redstone signals. So you have to you tune it to a certain frequency and it sends a signal when it's powered. So that's how I did that whole thing. And I mean I can't make it longer than that. It's so weird that it stops. Anyway. Um But yeah, it's it's basically it detects it gets powered. I was saying I ask silly questions, you know, I'll have to answer them. No, no, but it's it's uh, interesting to like have a critical uh, approach to everything. It's 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 interesting to to have that. I think it's something very important to take even what you like and what's 
yeah, what, what you enjoy and see what do you not like about that. It's just, yeah. But yeah, basically, go away, baby zombie. There's torches everywhere. You shouldn't be spotting here. It's so weird that they don't work. Is there something I have to do with those? In order to make them work, my uh, magnum torches. It's so weird. Anyway, um, yeah, the, the way I made it work. I mean, look at that. Like, so that's the stock pass, which that's what detects the length of the ropes in the pulleys. And I put redstone links all over the place. So when I press the button, it starts this one here, which it make, changes this powered latch here. So it unpowers this, that's a clutch, so it, when it's unpowered, it transmits the power, the, the rotational power. So like, and that's why it works, is that behind there, under that pile of dirt, there's a another redstone link and it's the same link that we have downstairs as well and yeah when i power either one of those it unpowers this it activates the the entire thing when it reaches uh down that's what this one detects it takes the length for when it's it reaches the bottom uh, it sends a signal down that will uh, start the two clocks uh the, not the two, clock, the, the, the two uh, bells and then change things around so that instead of going down it starts going up and when it reaches up here like it powers again this power latch which is something super cool power latches like that they're, they're a really cool addition to uh to the game um but yeah powers them uh it powers that which uh switches or which powers the clutch which makes it stop and also sends a signal down that um, that switches the uh, rotation direction here, so that when it gets activated, it will go downwards instead of going upwards. It was a very brief summary of, of how it works, but all of that, it's just these little things here. There's nothing more than that to it, so yeah, I really like the fact that it makes things so, so tiny. But it kind of feels a bit... Uh, I don't want to say lazy, because it's not exactly what I think of that. But like... I saw you spawn, you jerk. You're not supposed to be here, stupid creeper. Um, sorry, sorry, sorry not what we're saying but yeah I, it, it just feels like an easy easy solution an, an easy way out of uh, like yeah just making things too much too easy I'd say but that's yeah one of the things that I don't like as much is like turning the electric part of, of redstone into electronic and like wireless electronic I'd say so yeah that's what I would say I'm a bit critical of uh, uh, when it comes to this mod these are the the things oh also something that I like I don't have a, a, a good solution for that something that uh, how it could be changed but when something's on a conveyor belt like if that thing is uh, like it, it can stay on the conveyor belt even if it's running and it will like for example this bucket here well, actually I can start it I'll show it to you but see like it was waiting for the arm to go uh, place it and then it, it stopped and the conveyor belt is still going. Um, might as well just power it as well. Uh, 
So yeah, that's uh, that feels a tiny bit weird when I was talking about like giving life to things. But then again, it would be so much more. Yeah, yeah, the desync is is a bit weird. The fact that it just stops, like there's no like if there was just a little something here that could grab the bucket, like like a mechanical arm, but not not mechanical arm like that, but just something a lot simpler than that. But just part of the animation that would just grab the bucket, lift it a bit, and then it it keeps like the conveyor belt keeps going, and when it's full, it drops it back into. Like, just that would make things, like, to, to me, even better, even more aesthetically pleasing. But, yeah, it, it's, like, uh, other than that, like, m having the player have to stop the conveyor belt so that it gets, uh, it, it, so that it, it fills the bucket or s things like that, that would just, that would be too much. It, would, it wouldn't really work. That would be bad. I wouldn't like that. And it would be so much more complicated. But anyway, enough complaining. Uh, what was I doing? I don't remember. Let's throw that away. Can always keep these logs. Uh, where are they? It's where it is. I don't need sticks. Yeah, I don't need sticks. Um, <clears throat> vertical slabs. Yes, that's where I was. I wasn't complaining about vertical slabs. I was wondering how it would work. Yeah, there's a few things I have to test with that. Can I take planks, vertical planks, slabs, and vertical slabs? I'm gonna take my glue. to bring <clears throat> my yeah. actually I can just jump down got to bring a hand crank where is it there it is come back come back you Okay, so... Yeah, so just to show you how it works. Like, that's how the Ferris wheel is gonna work. So the uh, mechanical bearing does that. And... I glue them both together. I don't know if you notice, but the other mechanical bearing that I just added is also rotating, so... Let's say I put... Oops. Put it like that. And like that. See, it kind of keeps it stable. So there's gonna be like one mechanical bearing in the middle that's gonna rotate the entire wheel. And there's gonna be some more of those little smaller, well, not smaller, but uh, mechanical bearings 
everywhere all around it. It's gonna be eight of them. That will be uh that will uh I forgot what I was saying. Uh that will move the uh the little carriages. Um Okay, so let's say I put this like that, this like that. I go sleep because my torches don't work. I don't really remember, but have you played a lot of uh, modded Minecraft, Dev? Yeah, it's cool how they made them. Let's say I put it like that and I glue everything together. Oops. That's good enough. So if I wrote it like that, uh, that's annoying. And what if? Okay, I'll always place one. Oops, no. Cool. Only place when near initial angle. Wait, no, first I need to bring it back to how it was. Okay. So basically, the issue that I'm uh, trying to figure out is if I rotate it, will it keep its initial angle? So if I stop it like at a 45 degree angle. Because I'm gonna have eight carriages, so like the corner ones, when they're at the bottom, it's gonna be like everything's gonna be at a 45 degree angle. So I don't want it to uh, stop at that angle. To like, uh, or when it stops at that angle, I don't want it to like keep on rotating until it's at a the the, the good angle that it should be at. Like, I want to keep it rotated, and I don't want the uh, the blocks to... Uh... Uh, okay, yeah. See? That's... That's what I want. Uh, that's great. Oops. Made a mistake. Okay, that's that's nice. Um, the the only true like mod bag version was Sky Factory Three. Uh, but that one has these chicken. I, oh yeah, I've seen it. Gold diamonds and stuff. And another mod that you use the net to make the chicken items. Yeah, I've I've seen that. I'm uh, I was not necessarily a a big fan of the thing, either. To be honest, but yeah, the uh, I I remember seeing that. Yeah, it's, it's an interesting mechanic and all of that, but uh, yeah. <coughs> the 
it feels a bit too much for me, to be honest. Um, but, but, but... Um, I've been using a lot of uh, <clears throat> Blossom. <coughs> Sorry. I've been using a lot of that uh, Blossom wood. So I think I'm going to keep using it. Like if I put the vertical slabs, I'm just gonna put the uh, blossom ones, just to see if it has the right width. Dang it! Yeah, that that works. That really works. Um, okay. Okay, so. Uh, I'm gonna... What I'm gonna do is... Yeah, I, I figured out what I'm gonna do. I'm just going to change it all to the Blossom Wood. Instead of the, uh, what's it called? Zelkova Planks. It's not a bad color. I wanted to make it different because I had already been using Blossom Wood, but it's going to work and it's going to allow me to have um, slabs and, and all that stuff in the build. So that's something that makes me happy. Gonna be quite useful for that. So let's just drop all the Zilkova stuff here. And grab more Blossom. How much do I have? I got plenty. I won't need the vertical slabs. Uh, vertical planks, sorry. And the maple is gonna... gonna keep it here. But I won't really need it. Uh, so... Here, I won't need my glue. And, oh, I need stairs. Stairs. Just gonna try and organize my stuff a bit better. Then... How it currently is. Am I gonna need more stairs or more slabs? Yeah, I'm gonna need more stairs than that. Um That's gonna be a good start. good thing is it's gonna allow me to use slabs and stairs like around the edge of the um, of the wheel so it's gonna feel a, a bit rounder than or even rounder than it currently is just gonna Change it all for the back one.
Um, and of course, it's like time already. Of course. Just gonna finish the middle part here. And then I can go sleep. grab those blocks back because you never know when you're gonna need them It's gonna be good. Just gonna need to do something to avoid falling all the time. And that thing is making a floor. <laughs> That's really gonna help me. No. Okay, vertical slabs, I don't need them at the moment. I need stairs. Okay. You know what? It's gonna be easier like that. I won't need my pickaxe, I guess.
Um, oops, I need to go up there. Place some more slabs, and I'm gonna have a full block there. Another super fun mechanic that we have in, I think it's part of, well, no, it's part of a better Minecraft, but it's probably just another mod, but the, the ability to crouch, like you press C and you're crouching, literally. You don't need like an elytra to, uh, and to jump. And activate the elytra and fall under a block and all, all of that. You can just uh, yeah, you can just press one button and you're good to go. That's how big that part is. Yeah, okay. So I can already tell that I'm gonna remove. I'm gonna keep all of that hollow or well, empty. Because I don't need to have that big flat area like that.
and that's almost done sorry i really went silent for a while there but yeah that's good almost done Let's look at what we have so far. Does it look good? Yep, yep, it does. Whoa, that was scary. Please go away. Thank you. That was scary. Uh. Wrong button. Yeah, again with the uh, crouching mechanism, it's really cool or mechanic, or me not mechanism, but it's it's really cool. It really helps you build. Just it allows you to get a better angle sometimes when you're trying to place a block. That did not work. Yeah, let's go grab that one block that was floating. Of course. Oh, wait. 
Snowball. Welcome back, Dev. You really didn't miss much. <laughs> Good. 
So of course there's gonna be a, a lot more like decorations and stuff. I'm gonna add more colorful blocks like within the, the how do you call that? Those straight lines that connects from the middle to uh to the the, the rim of the uh, the wheel. What's the word I'm looking for? Spokes, thank you, yes. I knew it. I just wanted to, uh, to, you know, make you feel useful. <laughs> uh, I'm funny. I'm funny. Um, so now what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and make the wheel a bit rounder. So I'm going to go here at that. Uh, I could add one more here. Not really, not really, uh, instead I'm gonna, actually you know what, I'm gonna remove everything that I just did, and I'm gonna make this one out of the, the blossom wood, then I'm gonna make this one rounder because it's gonna be a lot easier to see. Wait, do I have free cam? Do we have free cam? No, we do not. That is a shame. Because <clears throat> it would really have helped. Yeah, anyway. Anyway. It's alright, we can. We will survive. We will survive. Um, so, let's go and start with that. Oh, one dirt block. Thank you. Placing blocks on the on the underside of blocks, although like we can already do that. <coughs> I 
I could place the block, you know, here, like that. But still, I'm I'm more used to placing blocks where I'm uh, where I'm looking. Oop. Stupid snow made me crouch. So I uh, I tend to do it like that a bit more, but like. Here, 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 and here. Without crouching. Or without crawling. But, you know. That works just as well. Also easier to crouch if you click on the right button instead of just switching your stakes and your uh, axe. But you know, different strategy, I guess. Did I add electro swing to the? Um, the mix? No, I did not. That's a song that I've had for a while on my uh, like that that I've used for a while now. I've I've used it in videos a few times, and it doesn't really count as electro swing, I'd say. Actually, no, it, it, that's not like the swing at all. So, yeah. Take that. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying that. Uh, Always have to be the the heckler. Hey, it's all right. You <laughs> you're good. <laughs> you troll. It's okay, I forgive you. <laughs> um... Okay, so now it's slab time. Actually, no, it's 
Time to clean up my inventory. Does that sound electro swing to you, uh, Dev? That, that, does that song sound electro swing as well? So look at that, I found these weird blocks. So strange. They're spiral bricks. They're craftable, <clears throat> craftable and everything. It's just strange and they have a different texture I think depending on how you place them yeah to make the spiral like you see here these two lines are parallel like they or they, they end at the same place and here they they don't I don't know if they have a purpose or, or I'm, I'm guessing they have a purpose it's in twilight forest so they're probably part of a like a weird decoration of, of a Kind of a dungeon or something. I think that's what Twilight Forest is about. Like some weird dungeons and stuff like that. I think. I'm not sure. Because they, they, they're just named Spiral Bricks, so it kind of makes me think that they're just decorative. It's just the fact that they have a spiral. Like it, it's the only thing that, that matters. Um... If it could stop snowing, it would be great, though. It would really be great. But, you know. You know. Can't ask too much. So, I'm guessing... I'm gonna try and round it out. Just from the outside first. Because I don't know exactly what kind of... Uh, what thickness we're gonna have on the other server it's rained every day for like three days yeah uh, which one was it? One dot eighteen, I think, was the rain update when it, it just rained all the time. It was so annoying. Um. Here we could have slab. That works. 
That's okay. I'm gonna put the stairs here. Um. Wait, no, earlier I tried with the stairs. Uh, can I not get the right? Ah, dang it. Can't get the right angle for that. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do it on both sides and I'm gonna compare. Wait, no, I don't need to, because that's ugly. Well, that made things easier. Let's make a staircase here. Oh, why? I did that. But yeah, problem solved. That's ugly. No, nope. you go there. You go there. And you should be stairs. Although, did I use? Yeah, I used the stairs. Thing is, it makes a weird straight line. So, I'm gonna try it and pick those blocks back. Um. weird well then again there's a big straight line there as well so it's okay How does it look? How does it look? Um, not that great. So you know, with slabs and stairs and now vertical slabs, they really need to add like half slabs or well, quarter blocks. You know, just fill in that corner here. That would be great. But, you know, we can't have nice things. Kind of just like the, the top of a stairs. Like you have a stair and you got a slab. Just that little bit here. Sticking it in that corner there and in that other corner there. Uh, Mojang. Fix your game. Why didn't just stairs work here? Also, why am I just jumping instead of scaffolding? Everyone knows that doesn't work. Wait, what was wrong with that? Because that's perfect. It's literally perfect. Why was I complaining? Also, you know what? I'm gonna put some here. 
Like that. Yeah. That's good. Or would a slab be even better? Yep. Slab's better. Uh, I'm gonna go on top. Make the top part of it. Um... We got that here. I hate snow so much. Like it, it ruins my real life and my, my Minecraft life. Knows the worst. So then it's a stair, lab, three stairs. One thing I don't like about vertical slabs is that when they're in your odd bar or even in the inventory, but mostly in the odd bar, sometimes it's a bit harder to see which one's which. Might just be me who's bad at seeing, but yeah. They do look a tiny bit similar. Why is there a fly? You're supposed to be frozen. Go away. No. Um. Three stairs, one slab. Oh, one slab here. Then it was a stair. Or was it another slab? Yeah, there, then two slabs. There, slab, and a slab. Perfect. Two slabs. There. 
there it go we'll wait nope oh, I don't want you stupid snow um get that then it's gonna be said I don't want you stupid snow and then gonna be here And we are all done. I don't need that either. Maggots. I don't want to have that in my inventory. Okay, that's that's a very, very cool looking wheel. I love it. I love it. Um... Mm. So now it's time to change these two. Well, not just these two, just change the entire thing. Wait a second. Okay, no, it's this one block. That wasn't in the right place. The other ones are okay. Ooh, okay. Okay. That was scary. Wait, was that the one that I just broke or that I just added? Might have been. Um, then we have those three. of them. No, it's this one. Oh, and there's two. That's great. Mm, I'm gonna have to chop down the entire forest, apparently. Okay. That's better. I mean, it's not good because I had to chop down the entire forest. But you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Uh, 
Uh, so now we're here. That's this there that I added. No, nope. needed a vertical slab. I guess so. Then. Here and that here. Perfect. First try. Perfect. Now, let's do the same thing on the other side. Nope, that was wrong. Um, just there. Do I have more of those? Okay, perfect. Um, I really should have just cut down all the trees in the area first. That would have really been like, the smart thing to do. kind of a weird sound but I think it was in the song kind of felt like I don't know something kind of powering up or kind of a motor starting <laughs> that's weird that was weird I think it was in the song and not in the game So, are you playing uh, Dev on the uh, the other server right now, or? You said earlier that you were afraid of some uh, creeper noises.
Um... That's strange. Took me a lot more regular slaps than vertical slaps, somehow. And I almost, I pretty much had the same amount, I think. Anyway, I might have lost some. That's probably what happened. Probably some that got dropped on the ground and that I didn't grab. It despawned. Um. Yeah. Gonna need to go and craft a bit more blocks. Whee. Did I say I like this elevator? Did I say that already? I'm not sure if I've said it already. I really like this elevator. I would prefer if it worked properly, but, but, I like the elevator. And I can drop my Zalukova blocks. Also, I can drop this one grass block. And I don't need the spruce. I won't need that. Perfect. Let's head back up. clicked on everything Was at the same height. Yeah, they seem to be. They seem to be at the same height. I got to put the side slabs here. Thank you. 
let's go sleep and then we can see the full thing Where did you come from? Where did you all come from? It's supposed to have like a 96 block radius or something. Those stupid torches, they just don't work. Like there was no indication of anything more than that. Like, that they needed to be activated or anything, as far as I know. Like, m mobs shouldn't even be spawning anywhere close to that. Do I have to? I don't know. Place it on a torch or something? No. How are they meant to work? Mob type creature. What does that imply? What's that supposed to mean? Our horizontal range 128 block. I'm gonna assume it's 128 blocks on each side. Because it's not the width of the area, it's the range. So, 128 blocks that way. And 64 blocks up and down like that. That's enormous. Like I'm at... 394. So it should be like... 530... No. 394, so 524. Like, that torch all the way over there should be spawn proofing the area up to here. Unless I, I can't understand anything. But like, th th there should not be any mobs anywhere around that. W what's the part that I don't get? What's the part that I don't understand with that thing? And it's super annoying. Like, sure, they're supposed to have some spawns somewhere, but they shouldn't be close enough to, like, wander. Like, two creepers and one zombie wandering close to me with that torch. Right? Or are they... So that's monster. What's the difference? Water ambient, water creature, underground water creature. Ah. So what's the difference between creature and monster? What would the difference be? I mean, it's, it's not very, like, explicitly obvious that there's a difference between the two. Creature and monster are kind of synonyms. That's super weird. Super, super weird. Um, okay. So, I can already guarantee that at the rate at which... We're building so far, uh, we won't have time to make the entire thing. Also, I'm starting to regret making it two wheels thick because it, it, it becomes kind of heavy. Huh. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. We will see. What we do with that. 
And yeah, I'm starting to think like those spokes, maybe there should be only one set of those. But, but, but. We will see. Um, remove that. is to place all the mechanical bearings. Uh, dang it. It's not the right way. them all Wait, what's wrong? Oh, ah, uh, that's what it is. Okay, I see. So if you shift click, it's gonna place in the direction that you're looking, and if you just place it, it's gonna be placed in uh, so that it's facing you. That's interesting. Well, that makes things a lot easier.
let's go sleep and then we can see if we can make this whole thing spin although I uh, just realized I forgot to make it so that it just spins like uh, like it doesn't place the blocks when it's really oh though no that that won't change anything for these ones okay no that's fine um what should I make the middle part out of we're gonna need kind of a gigantic beam type of thing so like a, a beam uh, an axle more than a beam uh, maybe maybe we could use uh, Welcome back, Dev. So far, so good. Wait, I'm gonna need... I'll take that. So far, so good. The, uh... I've made both sides of the wheel. I made both sides of the wheel, as I was saying, before I got rudely interrupted by my elevator stopping. And um, I uh, I now kind of, sort of, regret it. Sort of, because um, it feels really, really heavy and massive. And like having both like that kind of feels a bit weird. So yeah, I'm not too sure what I'm going to do with that, but that's the future me. That's a problem for future me. So now what I want to do is... Uh, is go and activate it, and or activate it, place the things that are going to make it actually rotate. I forgot to bring my glue. You know what? Look at that. I'm gonna start it and hopefully it's gonna be at the bottom when I come back. But probably not because I had to stop it. Glue. No, too slow. Also, you missed a lot of complaining about Magnum torches because they don't seem to work. For some reason. So um now I'm gonna make a big axle in the middle here. The magma block. Do you mean the magnum torch? Because I was talking about magnum torches. Wait, how did I count the blocks that I would need? Um, they don't seem to work. Well. So what it says is it works for... Well, there's one that works apparently for creatures. And one that would work for... Um, for monsters. And I have no idea what the difference is. But I've been getting creepers pretty close to my place. And they're supposed to have like... A uh, 128 
block uh, reach. Like it's a cuboid with like 128 blocks. And not even the width, but the, the distance from the torch. And still... Oh, well, we can see it here. So I made an emerald one. So horizontal range, 128. So it's, it should be like 256, then 257 block width for one torch. And I, I get mobs that are way closer than that. That like wander close to my place. So that's uh, super annoying. Super, super annoying. Oh, also in the voice chat with these. That's totally alright. But yeah, you're uh, on the on your server, on the other server. At the moment, I assume. a raid farm that's cool i've never built a raid farm never built one of those Renewable redstone, yeah. I'm guessing they're better than witch farms. I'm assuming. Oh, wait, no.
What? Oh. I get it. I forgot my hand crank. Dang it. Um. Which farms got nerfed in the cave update? Yeah. Uh, would ha would would change with uh, which farms? In the in the cave update. I'm not sure. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah. You, you explained it. The message right after, of course. Um, mob spawning starts at minus 64 and makes it way up to the top. So the higher the mob farm, the slower the spawns. Yeah. So it's uh, the same old mechanics as we had before, basically. spawned outside of the range of the four torches that I've placed and somehow made its way back here like specifically where I was and started shooting me there's no way that happened Yeah, I've never really played around with raid farms, but yeah, I've heard that you can do some uh, pretty, pretty efficient stuff with them. That's really cool. See, there's... Again, there's another one. And again, my stupid elevator. Won't work. As always. Silly elevator. So I wonder if I can move the entire thing with just a hand crank. I'm guessing the mechanical bearing as like a uh, gives it has a stress unit output that depends on the uh, the amount of blocks that it moves. I'm assuming that's how the how how that works that thing because come on, stupid skelly. Baby skeleton. Yeah. We needed that. Also, give me that back, you jerk. Give me that. That's not yours. Thank you. Um... 
Just so I'm gonna do that to be like that. The right one, right? Um only place when anger destroyed. Perfect. to do. Okay. Whee! Okay. Perfect. Um, so now, I'm not gonna clean the snow yet. Uh, glue is made from slime. It's uh, like slime balls and, and some iron. Oops. Yeah. yeah. Iron sheet, iron nugget, and slime balls. Yeah. annoying. Like that area is too big. Okay, so that's a 24 block range that makes it too big, I assume. Again, stupid gravity, always there to annoy me.
Whee! Oh, that was stupid. Why did I do that? Ah, uh, of course. I had been warned this would happen. Oh, that's. Mmm, that makes me mad. That really makes me mad. Uh, I'm gonna go and grab all my blocks. Ah, uh, they exploded everywhere. Uh. So basically what happened was there was a conflict between what block should be where so I was rotating just one bit of the wheel and yeah it's uh it I, I, I stopped it on top of a pre-existing part of the wheel so there was a conflict and the ones that were already there got removed because I'm a noob. I don't know what I'm doing. I shouldn't be playing this mod. <laughs> I think that's all the blocks. Um, let's just go there. Planned so I could go sleep.
There we go. As if nothing had happened. And even take this opportunity to start cleaning it up. Cleaning all the snow. The disgusting snow that fell on top of it. Dang it. Uh, shift and place. Okay. Perfect. Um Well, with all of that, let's attempt for a second time to place. and place it again, but I'm gonna go. Okay, first of all, remove that snow. No one wants you there, snow. Got this part. thing on that side. I'm gonna grab it from the bottom here. Uh, here. 
There's one thing that I find super weird with the glue. The, the mechanics of the glue. It's that I don't understand when uh, it gets used. Like there's a little uh, indicator like that shows how much is left in the well some kind of durability like right now it's at 53% let's just pretend it didn't happen and i don't know when it it goes lower to be fair i haven't really tried to find out but where Okay, so we got all that connected together. Let's try and see. Oh. Yeah. I think it's pretty obvious what I was uh, talking about earlier. Like I, I didn't know when it would uh, like it would lower. It, I think it's just it removes one percent when I use it or something. That makes sense. There's no like link to the size of the of the area that I've picked or anything like that. Actually, you know what? I'm being dumb. I can just pick this one here and go all the way back there. What? Stop doing that. seems to be stuck together that's good
Yeah, I see you, stupid zombie. Reminder that I've wasted so much on these stupid torches that do not work. Any more mobs? No. Okay. Oh. I see how I should have done that. I'm gonna make the other one a bit better next time. Um Die please. Yes you. Please die. Thank you. Okay, so now I think to remove this, but I think everything's connected together, so we could try and rotate it. Just to see it in action before we end the stream. Well, we won't really see it in action all that much because I'm gonna activate it from up here. But you, you get what I mean. You get what I mean. I did not select that.
Whee! Yay! It works. And there doesn't seem to be anything that isn't being connected. That's perfect. Perfect. I'm just gonna... That's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. I'm gonna eat. Yay! It's alive! Whee! It goes a bit too fast, let's be honest. It, it really needs to be slowed down. Just a bit. But you know. For the moment, that's perfect. That's just perfect. I love it. I love it. And, well, just before we end, I just want to see, like, if we placed some, uh, some blocks here, just to, to mimic the um, little carriages. Just gonna make something I don't know what I'm trying to do here uh, something like that and I should have kept that because I'm gonna need to put some glue on that otherwise it won't stick together there we go all of that and now it should. I'm gonna put it in the, the free rotation mode. And it should. It does. It works. We're gonna have the coolest Ferris wheel in the world. Needs to go back a bit like that. Perfect! Alright, it works, it's alive, we still need to do some stuff, mostly all the create mod stuff for it to actually work, but other than that, it works. We're gonna have to uh, redecorate it a bit more, so do something a bit better than that with it, but, <clears throat> but uh, that's great, we did something. It's alive, it works, I love it. But we're gonna end stream on that note, because it's been four and a half hours. It's been long enough. There's zombies, I think, around also, so I'm scared. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, for joining me, for those who did. And have a fantastic day also, it's the 31st of December, so it's New Year's Eve. So happy new year to everyone, and yeah, bye. Gonna sit down here, there we go, there we go, perfect. So yeah, bye bye, have a good rest of your day, happy new year.